wife warned me. My wife. Have nothing to do with that righteous man, she said. Now Herod has ordered that I execute my men for abandoning their post. They were guarding the tomb of Yashuath Natsarath that morning. I assume you heard what happened. They reported that a man appeared to them in a bright light. Some of them ran off. Others fell down. The ones that fell down have no memory of what happened. The seal of Rome had been broken. Capital crime. Of course, there's no one to arrest. We've searched house to house. We can't find the body. His followers are nowhere to be found. My wife is, of course, ecstatic. The Jewish Christ is risen, she said. She's been taking gods down from around the house all month. We don't know where the body is. We know where it is not. Just yesterday, one of my own commanders came to my home and said, I have seen Yahshua and Zareth. I said, wonderful. I assumed he meant they found the body and this was all over with. You know what he said to me? Apparently, Yahshua and Zareth appeared to him in his own home where he eats, out of thin air, showed him his wounds and vanished again. Out of thin air. Messengers recently came from Rome and informed us that the earthquakes that took place just as the man died were felt at Kaiser's palace in Rome. We know that they split the temple in Yudha and Naf. Caiaphas is, of course, unavailable to explain anything. They're coming to me. I have no answers. Out of thin air. I cannot bring myself to execute my men. They're like sons to me. I gotta get them out of the province. I cannot, get this mis I cannot get this man's face out of my head. He said to me, his kingdom was not of this world. Could it be true? What is truth? What is truth, Pilate says.